My name is Vance Benton and I'm in my 11th year serving as the principal of Patterson High School where great things happen every day. Now, today is just not a good day as Ice Cube would put it. Today is a great day. What it means, it means that we matter. It means that we are deserving, and it means that people really care about the lives of our students and our staff. Today is about a just position, because you can see it. If you go outside, Mr. President, you can see what we thought about our children and what we think about our children today. My classmates and I are extremely excited about the opportunities we will have at Patterson. Students will be able to access fully air conditioned, illuminated classroom with wide range of modern technology for the first time in Patterson High School history. And our fine arts and creative, creative student organization have access to top-notch equipment to make multimedia, music, and dance production in every changing way as possible. This alone is a $100 million investment into our most uh, precious resource, uh, our young people. We know that we're doing it. We know that we have to do more. We know. If you've been in this building, you know that great things were happening every day in a building that we wouldn't want to have people who are in prison for murder in, let alone our young people that we're expecting to lead our next generation. So imagine what's gonna happen when they have all the access and technology that you heard Cord talking about. It's more than just bricks and mortar. It's about telling them that we are investing in them in their future and that we truly believe in them. But it's been Corey, it's been Principal Benton, it's been the teachers, the faculty, and the students of places like Patterson all throughout this city that have been doing it. We would not have these new buildings today, Tuesday, the ones that are to come and the ones that have already opened if thousands of black, brown, and white parents, students, community activists, alumni, and teachers had not advocated and demonstrated over the course of years for educational equity and modern school buildings for the families of Baltimore City. Mm -hmm.